Today, I am going to teach you all how to do a survey using just Google Earth Pro, a very useful technique for engineers and planners. Let's start. You must have Google Earth Pro installed on your laptop or PC. You can see the software icon. Let's open the software. You will see it opening. Just click close on any pop-up window. Now you can search for the place where you want to do the survey. Here, I typed Kathmandu. And let's select these hills as our survey area. Let's explore this. You can easily rotate the view using your mouse scroll button. Try it, and you'll see a beautiful view too. Now, click on View Reset Tilt and Compass to reset the tilt of the image. Click on the pin icon shown on the screen, place the pin at the top of the hills, and name it Final Point. If we were building a road here, this would be our final point. Click OK, and you will see the point added to the left-hand sidebar. Similarly, place another pin at another location and name it Initial Point. Now we have both points added. Oh, such a beautiful view. Let's add a polygon by clicking the polygon icon. Click the mouse left button to cover the area you want to survey. Name this as Survey Area and click OK. After that, click on the Add Path icon. Use your mouse left button to click and create the path. The more points you add, the better. More points will create better detailing and a better model. Now you can see the layers, final point, initial point, survey area, and survey points. Right click on the survey points layer and click save place as. Save the file into a folder. Here, I am saving it on the desktop as a. KML file. You can give it any name. I am naming it Survey Points. Now open your browser and search for GPS Visualizer. Click on the link as shown. When the link opens, click on Convert a File. Then, choose the file we created earlier. You will see the file added. For elevation data, select Best Available Source and click on the plus icon. For output UTM coordinates, select Yes. Click on Convert. You will see your data previewed. Click on Download to download the file. Now, open the Downloads folder and open the downloaded file. You can see the survey data here. Press Ctrl plus A to select all, Ctrl plus C to copy. Then open Excel and press Ctrl plus V to paste the data. Delete any unwanted columns. Here, I am deleting a few. And add a new column to number your points. Finally, save the file in CSV format, for example, on your desktop. In our next video, we will learn how to create contour lines in Civil 3D using this point file. Thank you. Follow and subscribe for more such videos.